By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. America was becoming a land of laws. Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Forty-seven. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay, Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Oh, Dutch, you are so kind at this point. Whether it's May, just hope that the law got as lost as we did. There, Arthur. Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Found the place. <laughs> yeah, the prologue's pretty story heavy. I don't mind it, but it is very story heavy. Um, not a lot of action going on in the prologue, but except that one, just that one camp. Open world type stuff next time. I do have to do something with the brightness on my end, though. Bring him in here. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, okay. see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was <laughs> nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Yeah, Dutch was the First guy here, state, right? And you were gonna get then later on, you're like, one. all right. Sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Went to your head. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. See if we can find one of them. And this? And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had... Dude, uh, honestly, no. And I want to. Like, my goal right now, because I've never played RDR1, is to play this and then play RDR1 for the first time later on. Yeah, man, it's... it's, it's, it's... Sean, Mac... I mean, okay. we don't know. I know the plot and the story of it, and I think it's uh, yeah. um, so I know like what happens, Throw but I still want to play it again just to get to that point. Cause I, I swear, if I had played that before I learned Dude. the ending, oof, it would be one of those Last of Us but type moment, right, where you just get the, the emotional shit going on. We are gonna find um, some food, everybody. But, but yeah, I did. I did. I, I watched a couple like videos, like gameplays on YouTube, but not like too much of it. Um, but it's definitely something I'm, I'm interested in. Well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. Long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Well, Mr. Get, Pierce, get ready for the next hundred hours, show. Dutch. <laughs> of worse. Into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you. Get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay strong. Stay with, with me. me. We ain't done yet. Right. 
So I mean, like, like I said, like I've heard, I've heard, like I have friends of mine who've done it, and um, again, I don't know all the plot points of one, but I do kind of understand the character arc. It just changes the shit out of your whole mindset with these people. That, that, I mean, that's genius. What's what they did? What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Yeah, blame someone else, right, Dutch? Hey, you need horses? Oh yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. <laughs> All right. We All right, here we go. Strong. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's funny you mentioned that. The, the prologue is very much. I mean, obviously you have to learn how to play the game, but like. <laughs> Yeah, the murder rate in this game is probably one of the best, or the highest in all of gaming. <laughs> I'm tapping it. There we go. Well, yeah, that's, I mean, that's legendary levels. I want to slow your horse down. Or just let go of X, right? Shit. Come on. I almost call them Roach because I'm playing Witcher 3 right now, too. <laughs> Can't believe we lost Davy, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No, no more. more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't <laughs> need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. No, I, I think this is Micah, right? Mike, we, we come up with Mi Micah, right? What about the money? What about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? It's Micah. Oh. Speaking of some bitches. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? <laughs> I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? I love it. I do like it though. I mean, all all kidding aside, I like it because you have like a story arc, right? I mean, how's Davy doing? You know. And that's what new games do. Newer games do. They do awesome storytelling. Uh, they were. The heat. Yeah. <laughs> Some. Yeah, it was it was humorous. No, it was good. Like, don't get me wrong. Um, it was like I don't have any beef with this game whatsoever. Every everything they did story wise and all that worked. It was just a very big distraction out of nowhere. They came out of nowhere to me anyway. Um, having not really heard any of the story before I got into the Let's game. So Let's hitch up here. All right. Approach the engine post. Probably pressed. Yeah, it's up there, man. It's definitely up there. I love Witcher 3 as well, which I'm also playing like on YouTube streaming, but um, but yeah, this is a, well, this is one of them. Come on, now I just hit triangle. I haven't played Hitman in a long time. Man, I've not played Hitman, but that was like one of the first initial stealth games, man. Someone's having fun in there. Play the hell out of them, man. That's awesome. We just arch move camera and check oh, on Micah. Gentlemen. Where's Micah? We can't help you, Mister. All right. Folks. Arthur. Arthur. Arthur, we got a problem. Yeah, I see him. I see him too. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. Oh shit! All right. There's a body in the wagon. Oh, I hear you. Just tell him. Keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Over 
There you go. Got him, Dutch. X, wrong button, Arthur. <laughs> I said I'd handle this. Didn't seem to be going too well. Yeah, dude. Uh, let's go, go case of joint. Alright, canned fruit. There we go. Alright, this works. Just starting the game off nice and nice and slow. Was it take biscuits? Madison chest. Here we go. Uh, take the open open health cure. Okay, I'll take a couple of those. Okay, so I'm a, <laughs> poor bass was married too. I'm not necessarily gonna do 100%, but I do want to do this game justice. All right, let's go. Just give me a minute. Give me a minute, Dutch. You son of a bitch. I know you're gonna betray us anyway, so. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. All right, open the barn door. And then get ready to punch the motherfucker, man. Whoa! He started. What's going on? What's going on? What do you see? What do you think is going on, Dutch? Well, that's gonna be the share of them. I'm gonna kill him this time. No. I didn't kill him last time. Hold out to the focus. Grab the old disco. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. There you go. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? Really? You gonna make at an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. Oh, you gave up quick, huh? What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? They're not. Well, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than That's that such a cool swim. mission, too. The train mission is awesome. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I we'll choke care. him out. I'm gonna Bring choke him out. Horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know uh, else. choke. See ya, man. Use L2 to focus on the horse. Press square to calm the horse. Easy, horse. Easy. Yeah, good boy. <laughs> that looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. My God, you dumb son of a bitch. Miss, nah, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. No harm. Miss, come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. Oh. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Yes. 
It's okay. I do like when it goes open world later on, but the linear side of it is like, at least you know you're kind of just getting it's to the okay. point, slowly making your way. You're not missing anything. I think I can't wait to get the the open world, but What's your name, we do gotta get this stuff done. Miss. Adler. Sadie Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I. He. He was my husband. Oh. Such an opening. Somebody's coming. Easy, pal. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. The O'Driscoll boys. Plane. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is, but we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up, give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. Still not Mike up near her. Turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Now how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk <laughs> bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to Easy. Bed. You son of a bitch. Enter, pursued by a memory. He ain't been seen in days. Let's go get Marson, baby. Let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? How you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got <laughs> himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted <laughs> iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. <laughs> I know... The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Good point, Javi. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, yeah. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. There you go, let's go kill some wolves. He kept riding north and never looked back. <laughs> he wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope right, more of right behind you. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a mm. bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Oh, okay. Hold that. <clears throat> we'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Changing them when I came across R3. Oh, I, n I never knew that. Obviously, I knew that, but I think I forgot after the beginning of the game. 
I don't see anything, but I'll follow you. Oh, this. Uh oh. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on, up there. That's like a face. Those rocks up there, doesn't it? <laughs> All right, where are where are we going? The zone. Uh, all right. John, just keep screaming. Where are you? It's coming from this way. Okay. It's slippery. Be careful. Yeah, no kidding. You know, fall all the way down there and Mars don't feel bad forever. And then the Red Dead Redemption's done. <laughs> 20 minutes. Okay. Good now. Mm. Hey, John! Oh, X crouches, right? Because X and Witcher's sprints. Oh, no. Does X run? Damn, it's cold. Right. down, Marston. <laughs> He's down here. <clears throat> Look what you got yourself into, kid. Scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. That's supposed to mean son of a bitch. I'm gonna save your ass. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good neither. <laughs> Freezing. <laughs> Don't die just yet, cowboy. Oof. Come on, compadre. That means compadre. <laughs> well, can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? <laughs> Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. Oh, don't be a dick, she Arthur. Oh, you all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully, this will lead us out. <laughs> Look up there. Him down. I'll distract him while you get to the horse. Go, draw them off. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. Stop being yeah, negative, Nancy. Not yet. Up there, four of them. Get out of here! Get out of here! Oh shit! Go! Uh, shit! There we go. More coming in on the left. Alejandro, let me. You see any more out there? No, Oof. think so. Jesus, you still with us, Marston? <laughs> I don't think I'm. I, I, don't, I don't think I hit any of them. Yes. Ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know. We're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. <laughs> so, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. 
Oh, mission. John! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Can we get some help? We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. All right, here we go. There we go. Oh. Ah, you oh. careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're going to get out of this. I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. Mm. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> we have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Thank you, son. For your strength. It means a lot to me. We weren't there, Jose. I'm aware of that. And they shouldn't have been either. All right, let's go find some missions. Um, let me try to talk to these people as many as much as I can in this playthrough. Huh? No. Um. Oh, you boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess. I guess folks miss them. That fell. But when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, <laughs> there'll be a party. <laughs> what a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. That funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> Come on, Micah. I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching yeah. each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Colm O'Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. Man. You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Combe always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. <laughs> I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. Yeah. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. Mm. You killed his brother, Dutch. <laughs> yes, I did. I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. Micah, you kiss ass. That smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Yes, boss. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Oh, yeah, I can't remember this. There they are. That's definitely them. 
home? You got four. So, yeah, that's him. Anyone else hiding anywhere? Don't think so. One, two, three, four. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. Well, there's five. No. Okay. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Good. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with it. <laughs> Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including comb, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Mm. Come on. Don't be scolding me, Dutch. Come on now. I got your back. I don't know you're going to betray me just yet. Steve here. Careful. Careful. Wow, thanks, Dutch. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there. First. Yeah, Arthur, let him go in front. <laughs> I don't want to die either. All right. Here we go. Show the weapon and go to the rifle. There you go. Okay, let's get in cover. Oh shit, he's right there. Ready for this job to be done. Game's going well so far. It'll be worth a few Haven't died yet, so that's good. Oh, that's our guy, it's Micah. Okay. Arthur, take this spot here to my left. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make, make the, the call. call. You want, you want to take, take lead? lead? Go. go. Call of Duty, yeah. Yeah, I love Call of Duty. I haven't played PUBG though. Oh shit, oh shit, I got my ass whooped. Oh god. Come on, stop hitting those freaking. Oh, take cover, take cover. Oh, I forgot how many there are. There's a bunch of them. Oh, there we go. All right, let's get back outside. Let's get back outside. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Stop uh, crouching, Arthur, let's go. <laughs> oh shit, someone behind me? Mo, Mo! Oh, there you are! That's right, get down. Boom! All right, is that it? That's a walk-off, baby. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. On top of where I'm figuring out what I'm getting. Who's shooting? Who's shooting? Forgot about the Oh shit! I also playing Jedi Survivor around here too. 
you gone, you gone, you gone. All right, well, oh, we still got some back here, all right? Ah! Woo! Use the time to restore dead eye. Okay. Well, let me get down. Let me, let's go loot everybody first, Dutch. Hell. Arthur, get over here. All right, you want me a badass man? All right, let's go. You son of a bitch. You better give us time to loot more. You suck it. We don't suck. have time to mess around. All right, let's go. What you got? Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. That's what I've been doing. What do we got here? What do we got here? Perfect. Plans. I think we're good to do on this. This is what we're gonna need here, probably. Hey. This, this looks good. good. What do you think, Bill? What do you think, Bill? Looks fine. Smells good. Smells good. Come on. Come on. Did we get everything? Think no, we left a bunch of bodies unlooted. One of them. Thank Cause you. you're in a freaking hurry. This is perfect. Dutch. Oh yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A uh, Mr. Leviticus, Leviticus Cornwall. Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. Can I loot or do I gotta follow you? Let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Ah, uh, let's go. God damn it. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and out. They can pummel us as hard as they like, but we will always, always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, yeah, I'm here, man. I'm here. I'm just, uh, Wait until we have yeah, I don't need any of that stuff right now. Um, like I said, though, I'll, I'll keep you in mind. Down the road, if I'm playing this a little more often or playing on the channel more, I, like you know, I have no problem with putting some money into it right now. I'm just playing, ha have some fun. Hey, you see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Comb? Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay. Oh, this is the lasso thing, right? Chase down and lasso the old disco. Gotta cut corners. You gotta cut corners. Fight for me! Ah, shit! No! Don't hurt me! <laughs> <laughs> Let's get you on my horse. Hog type people you're placing on oh, the back God, of your horse. No. I'm no use to you, really. We're gonna find out. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? <laughs> Kieran, Kieran what? Duffy, Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. All right, let's get this guy. Let me the crew. Here we are, you sack of shit. <laughs> let's introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. No, oh, don't worry. They're real nice. <laughs> well, don't worry, I'm not gonna be the one to hurt you. Huh. Look who we got. Shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. Who shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out 
<laughs> what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. There it is, the beginning of the next okay. chapter is that train. Now I think we're just doing bow and arrow work, right? I believe so. Go hunt, hunt us some deer. Yeah, we're in close to the end of the prologue, I think. Um, but we'll see, right? All right, Dutch, what you gotta say to me? Or not, or yeah, Dutch. What's up, Bill? You okay, Bill? Are we gonna hit this train then? Yeah, Is give it time. Way? For the city. Okay, let's go. Um, let's go do this hunting, hunting uh, adventure. <coughs> I think, right? We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. Oh yeah, we have a good deer. A few cans of food and a, and rabbit. a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got <laughs> in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. <laughs> we'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Here. You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted off. Yep. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Good point. Good point. Here, you take this. I can't use it and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. Yeah, Arthur, come on, that was obvious. I imagine. <laughs> come on, this way. All right, let's go. Back to work, baby, back to work. I gotta remember to put my uh, my visual not on the right side of my screen because I can't see what I'm picking up. Horse okay. stand will not drain on my screen. Okay. Stupid mistake. Still bad. It'll be fine in a day or two. Come on, let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. The wind's died down, too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now, shh. Stay quiet. Quiet, horses. Stop here a second. I see something. And slowly. You will make less noise when crouch. Press out through the crouch. Question is where is the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. Oh, these tracks. Duh. We want a good, clean kill. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just don't overdo it. Quick. I'm good. Just going hunting. Boom! Now let's try for another. Where's the other? Where's the other one? Jack now's attention by selecting call while aiming at it. 
This will give you a chance of a clean kill as they raise their head before fleeing. Okay. Where is the other one? When close, study an animal discover its quality. Study. White-tailed deer, okay. Oh, I missed them! Damn, I thought I had them. Damn! We need this meat. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm gonna call him. Boom! There we go. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You get the other one from way away. Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. There they are. All right. That worked. All right, now we can, yeah. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, man. Let's go catch them and just go right next to them. Oh, okay. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Twenty years, something like Woo. that. Twenty so, years. Boy. So the guard the R three. Yeah. He taught me to read. John too. He taught me a few other things. Him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. That saved me. Saved most of us. I'm gonna hitch time over here. Uh, hold it to remove the deer. Oh, duh. Okay. Takes a lifetime of practice to master. I'm a, I'm a writer, so I, I, I do uh, understand kind of doing client work and trying to hustle to, to get as much work as you can. So, um, but yeah. So if you want to send me, feel free. And uh, yeah, like I said, down the road, I probably want. What a surprise. To pretty it up a little bit. Loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Ah, he loves me real. <laughs> it's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy yeah. rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, sir. You ever have my Discord name on me right skin. now? I know that sounds stupid, but like... I think it's just Marco in Orlando. You're the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. All right. Skin that one that you dumped on the floor there. Approach the deer carcass. Yes, yeah, so I'm in Orlando, Florida, so I think I think the whole my name on Discord is Marco in Orlando. Um, I can double check though. But I mean, I'm, I can't double check now. I guess I'm playing. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> they always said you were a butcher. You know, you could <laughs> trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. You got it. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting. After all these years. Yeah, <laughs> well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. Is that the end of prologue? Or do I get another one? <coughs> Master Hunter Challenge. A few days later. Yeah, I think that is the end of the prologue. It's been a bad few weeks. But Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans. And Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and <laughs> dreams. Who the hell is Leviticus Cornwall? Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. 
Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. <laughs> you're still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur! I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but... <laughs> look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scrap. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. Hey, buddy. You see me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. Hide <laughs> your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, <clears throat> Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Yeah, the question is, is the train robbery going to the prologue or not? I forgot. Who is Leviticus Cornwall? He's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something <laughs> of ourselves. That a boy, Dutch. Horses ready. We have a train to rob. I'm in Florida. <clears throat> yeah, Autumn, I'm in, I'm in Florida. How about you? <clears throat> All right. Moving out. Follow me. Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. Stop, uh, Lenny. Running up right next to you here. Private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. Have you got a problem with that? <laughs> you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough. <laughs> the blows the tracks, we're gonna, we're gonna move need fast. move fast. I love all these voices in this game, boy. This game and all all the stuff's so cool. And look at the visuals. Woof. Oh, baby. Oh shit. <laughs> Boys, see? This is what I call a crew. Michael Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela. Javi School. Always the first man on his horse. Yeah, except a G is a D, as in dog, Orlando. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back. When I say, I say we go, go back. back, and that's the end of it. Money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money, once we work out how to cash them. <laughs> now everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. Come on. Look at that. Look at that crew, baby. Tranquilo. Look at that crew. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. I will when I'm done done playing, Autumn. I'm playing. I'm having fun here. All right. <laughs> I'll check it when I get off the 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 controller here. There you are. Sure? Of course. Huh. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. 
Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. <laughs> All right. Don't be a jerk. Oh, there it is. I kind of forgot this was in the prologue. Okay, this is good. All right. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. No mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? There you go. I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Here we go, guys. Here we go, boys. This is what we trained for. It's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. Ah, shit! Oh, I forgot about this. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find that moron? Who said it was fine? It's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Jump on the train. Here we go. Let's go. Here we go. No, we need to stop this train. There's another guard up ahead. You want me to take it? You got me good. Some fellas hold up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We are opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Hey, you got no way in here. That's enough. 
Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Uh, here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish. I'd step back, fellas. All right, give us all your stuff. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. Kill you. We didn't want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. What's your name? You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Hello. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? Working on it. I think I got him. Oh, I already have a cigar. Let, let, let's go. Let's hurry this along now. All right, all right, all right. What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you all right. get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. Yeah, I'm going to tie you guys up, and if that's not an option, I'm going to have to kill you. The rest of you, let's ride. Let's ride. Okay. Get on the train. Quick. Hold it. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on! Move! We won't tell a soul, I su Here. Get a move on! Let's steal some stuff here. Finish the looting. Hopefully those guys don't, like, start running and make me change my... Change my, uh... Mission here. I, I I gotta get this this train going. Get the hell out of here, so then I can get back to the camp and probably go to um, end of the prologue and the end of the stream. So take some candy. We can loot a bowl. Oh, look at all those guys in the in the in the snow. But we're just gonna get the guys in the train. Um, all those are gonna be here for a freaking hour just looting. Got anything else in here other than looting the people? Nope. And I can't wait to kind of move, move this thing forward. Start the train. Getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses Oh, Marston. <laughs> Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone <laughs> wrong with old Dutch. The music in this game is phenomenal.
Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. <laughs> That's such a cool intro, man. Oh, water. Uh oh, look at that back left wheel. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? <laughs> Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. <laughs> Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. All right. See, you ain't so useless after all. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite. Oh shit! What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Hmm. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. Deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stole them clean away from them, it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Mm. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people <laughs> pleasantly? We don't, in spite of Duchess talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. <laughs> hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. Whoops, I almost got lost. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. <laughs> and this place we're going. Wait, but what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. Horseshoe so Overlook. Overlook. It'll do for now. You're gonna now have to do. Think Dutch is really going You're gonna to have die. to do. It's just, you know, just maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. What are you working on there anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. 
I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. Pick them and learn my poppers, okay. Yeah, I, I, that's the thing, I want to do a lot more of the picking flowers and all that kind of stuff. Um, for this game. Getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Hmm. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. <laughs> Love it. You weren't wrong, Jose. This place is perfect. Are. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were on to something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. <laughs> we have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are my safe. Brother. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. <laughs> now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town, a little way down the track, named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember <laughs> right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp... Donate money and valuables to camp. It's slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, not <laughs> me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. I'm gonna take that jacket off. <clears throat> Here we go. Here we go. Chapter 2, baby. I'm going to call it a night, though. I want to just put a pro prologue tonight. As soon as we get control again. A couple of weeks later. <laughs> 